everyone, this is Chad with Good Creative Tutorial. Today I want to show you how to create a clipping mask with text, but instead of using a photo, you can actually use a video. It's a pretty cool technique in Photoshop. I'll show you a preview right here. So we have some text and a video is showing through wherever that text is. So you just press the space bar to play it. I'm going to show you how to do this. So go ahead and open up Adobe Photoshop, go to File Open, and you don't need to place a video, you can actually just go to File Open and open it. So I'm going to open a video of some jellyfish I took at an aquarium in Sarasota a couple years ago. And you'll notice at the bottom there should be a timeline panel. If you don't have that, just go to Window and then Timeline. And if you press a space bar, it'll play what's there so far. right? And what we want to do is we want to add a text layer. That is our first step, so choose the Type tool and just click anywhere and I'm gonna type in the word jellyfish and you want to make this uh, pretty large of course and a thicker font so I'm using impact and I'm gonna press the move tool and up at the top make sure show transform controls is selected then you can click and drag the corner and just drag it out instead of just changing the font uh, size manually at the top so once you have your resize done just press enter or return and what we want to do if you look over on the layers panel we have a text layer and a video layer right below it and if you hit that arrow on the video group one you'll see that the text is inside the group and that's what we want if it's outside of the group if it's down here just drag it so it's inside this group all right uh, so the problem though is we want this text below the original video layer so click and drag it below keeping it inside this video group and all we have to do is hold down alt on the PC or option on the Mac and hover your mouse in between the two layers uh, the original video layer and the text layer and making sure text layers below the video layer and all you do is hold down alt or option and just click with the mouse hovering in between then it creates a clipping mask and now we have that effect and on the timeline panel you can bring it back to the beginning, hit spacebar, and then we have our pretty cool effect. Now you might be thinking, well I don't like that transparent background, how do I add a background? Well that's really easy. Just create a new layer on the layer bottom of the layers panel, click and drag it to the bottom, and you can choose a foreground color if you want, choose some kind of color, and press alt backspace on the PC, or option delete on the Mac and you do need we are working in video timeline here so you'll notice now it's after we want it right under the same timeline so you might have to just drag it over alright so we're thinking in, in a timeline not just space with normal you know layers so if it doesn't show up right away just look on your timeline and make sure that layer is below the other um, so it's not after it so now if I press spacebar then we have our effect with the background. You could put a photo as the background as well if you want. So that's how you apply a clipping mask to text using a video. Be sure to subscribe for more Photoshop tutorials.